Hi guys, it's Todd. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Todd Vlogs. Branding! Um, so, today's video is kind of a little bit of a mashup. I'm going to go through a few things that I have decided to buy for my holiday, take to Florida, and I kind of wanted to go over a few other bits as well, some little sentimental things that I have that are Disney related. So yeah, let's get into it. It's a bit warm, so I'm looking a bit pink. Do apologise. First things first, right, okay, so Florida is hot. I've been there, I've lived there, I have experienced it, and there are a few things that you need to take to prepare and these have been recommended by a multitude of vloggers um, so I want to start off with these cooling towels they come like this it's got a little hook that you can hook onto your bum bag fanny pack your bag your rucksack anything so it's really super handy this brand I think I got two for $8.95 from Amazon um, and they come out looking like this Ooh. Uh, you dip it in cold water and then you give it a bit of a shake and then it cools. Some kind of scientific reaction, I don't know, something happens. I keep looking at myself and not the camera. So you can wear it like this. You can wear it like that if you're feeling a little bit more like a pirate. The turban. So yeah, these are meant to cool you down um, in the summer hot heat that is Florida. Um, it's gonna be in the 30s, 40s. It's needed. And the next thing, be right back. Whew. One speed, two speeds, three speeds. Oh, that's nice. This is an easy act. Oh, can you see that? An easy act. This has been a godsend whilst it's been super, super hot in the UK. Oh, it's even today. It's a little bit warm. So yeah, they're my little practical items that I have decided to purchase on Amazon. I will probably add to this collection, no doubt, in the future, um, before I go in September. So, eh, it's just too easy. When you've got Prime, especially when it's same day delivery. Prime, same day delivery. Why wouldn't you? So when I first booked this trip, I booked it directly with Disney first to do the accommodation, dining plan and tickets for all the Walt Disney parks. Bought my flight separately and um, because we wanted to go to Universal and, or, and Islands of Adventure, I had to purchase those tickets separately. So I used Florida Tix, which is another website that you can get tickets from. They do all sorts on there. And there's lots of places online that you can get multiple tickets from. So I ordered our Universal and Islands of Adventure tickets, our Mickey's Not So Scary tickets, and our Halloween Horror Night tickets from Florida Tick. So you can order it all in one go. And they even do a really handy deposit so you can just pay off in installments when you've got the money. Um, I just did it all in one go because I just wanted to get it out of the way. What came was really, really good actually. Um, I don't think they do this anymore, but it came in a gold, Solid gold packaging. Um, and inside was really, really cool. It came with a reveal pack. So it came with, um, how cool, oh my gosh. And some branded um, Florida Tate's bunting with Mickey's on as well. Some lanyards, which will come in really handy whilst we're out there. I know they're gonna be like, Walt Disney World branded and we'll be in Universal, but who cares? It also had like, these little clue things on as well. So I don't know if you can see that. So clue one, clue two, clue three, and clue four. But all these little things in this pack are great um, for if you are one of those people that wanted to do a cool reveal for your kids, they could go around the house looking for the clues. Um, they've also sent a one where you cut out all these um, letters that come to we are going to Disney World so they could go and find that put it all put the letters all together and it will spell out we are going to Disney World also these really cool little cut out tickets to say we're going to Disney World Woo a balloon I've just scared my dog 
Sorry, Ellie. It's okay. But yeah, I just thought that was really, really cool. And I keep looking at myself. Clothing. Because you've got to be on brand. You've got to be there. You've got to be... When you're in the Disney parks, you want a little bit of Disney, even in the water parks, which I'll show you later. First item, this really cool Donald Duck t-shirt. I liked the neck. This little detail here, I really, really liked. And of course it's Donald. I know it's light gray and sweat, but I really liked it. How much was that? That was 16 pounds from the Disney store. Second one I got was this really cute old school retro Walt Disney logo. I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of, yeah, a little bit silvery. Really, really cool. Also 16 pounds. I think all of these t-shirts were 16 pounds. <sighs> this is my favorite. I'm a massive, massive fan of this, this film. I think this film is super underrated, um, but I feel like there's like a little bit of a cult following out there. The Goofy movie. I mean, eye to eye is a jam. Powerline is an icon. The Goofy movie. Amazing. And then, probably my favorite pair of swim shorts I have ever, ever owned. Genie swimming shorts. Genie swimming shorts. These were 22 pound 40. Amazing! I'll be rocking them in Typhoon Lagoon, Blizzard Beach, at the pool, getting my genie on. So that was my little mini haul. Um, so they were super cute, absolutely loved them. I need my fan back on. Oh, I'm gonna put my fan on. Look at this pink face. Oh, would help if you turned it right way around, Todd. Also, Florida Ticks sent us our tickets in this really cool little pink folder comes like that. It says open for dramatic effect. And inside it has our tickets to Mickey's Not So Scary, which came like this. These were, these are the kind of tickets that you'll get if you are staying probably off property and um, you don't have a magic band or anything like that. So um, that's the kind of ticket that you'll get. I've got this as well. It's the I'm a big deal card. It says massive savings on dining, shopping, rentals, and more. I'm not too sure how much we'll get out of this, but it was a handy little extra. We've got our universal Halloween Horror Night tickets that came in a paper format like this, um, and then our universal uh, multi-day tickets that came like this. So that's our 14 day ticket, even though we're probably only gonna go for two or three days. Difference in price between a 14 day ticket and like a two day ticket was really, really small. So I was just like, eh. Uh, what's the point? It comes with all the cancellation and price match protection policy as well because I think I took out um, the £25 cancellation policy because if you have to cancel any ticket, I think it's £10 per ticket um, cancellation fee. Um, so that would be 60 quid um, I would be losing if I cancelled these tickets. Um, so it was a no-brainer really. Um, I'm not going to cancel them, but still, something could happen. I could you know, get really sick and not be able to go, which would be a travesty. So that's um, Florida Ticks um, ticked off the list. I really rate Florida Ticks. They were really, really, really good to use, um, really, really quick. The tickets came within a couple of days. It was great. Um, so moving on to a few of the little men sentimental things um, that I have. So the first thing, I wore them in my last video, are these Mickey ears with the little graduation tassel on. These are the kinds of ears that you get when you graduate from the International um, College Programme or Cultural Rep Programme. Um, you do a big graduation ceremony at the end of your programme where everyone gets together, you have a big party, a big blowout, and um, you meet and greet Mickey and Minnie. They give you a little um, diploma and these hats. It, these have lasted since 2008 um, and still in top notch condition. So that was amazing. Another thing that I got from my 2008 college program was this. This was really, this is kind of really special to me as well. So at the end of our training in entertainment, we got given this little jewelry box um, that was all to do with Snow White. Um, it was Disney family holiday celebration. Because of you, dreams come true 2007. 
so everyone that went through training in entertainment got one of these um, and it was celebrating the 70th anniversary of Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs and then on the back it's got Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs signature. Here's some of the detail on the side as well um, just to show you. This was a present for my grandma um, who's no longer with us um, so I wanted to kind of keep it as a memory of her as well as my trip there as well. Um, the next thing that I have um, that I want to show you are these um, Disney Showcase Collection ornaments. So I have one Eeyore here. I just love his little detail and his little tail. When I was working in um, Walt Disney World uh, in entertainment, you have to say that you were friends with them. And you can't say that you were that character. Um, so this was a friend of mine, little Eeyore. It was great. And the amount of middle-aged women that have Eeyore tattooed on them somewhere is shocking. A goofy one as well, because he's a goof. Everybody loves Goofy. Um, and my housemate um, also did the same programme but a, year, a couple of years later and he was friends with Goofy. So that's why we have Goofy. And then the last thing, which I find absolutely hilarious, um, it's Disney related, but it's also a present that was given to me by one of my best friends. A hilarious person and knows me so well. He knows that my favourite favourite film is The Little Mermaid and basically he got this done for me. I mean it speaks for itself. So yeah that's all for this vlog. I kind of wanted to show off a few little bits and bobs. I would show you Ellie who is my dog. She's currently asleep under a chair I don't want to disturb her because it's actually nice to have been able to get through this vlog without her squeaking in the background. Maybe the next vlog I'll introduce you to Ellie and um, share her little toys that she's got um, because there's lots of Disney ones. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for subscribing if you've subscribed already. If you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe, do what you need to do. I greatly appreciate it. I don't know what I'm going to do for my next video. Um, how do people do this? It's really stressful. I'm not the most organized person, so I've got a few ideas, but we'll see how it goes. So stay tuned for Todd Vlogs, episode three. Bye, Zeeth.